In this episode of King's Quest 3 to Air is Human, I show you how Gwydion can turn the tables on his sinister captor Mananen and transform him into a cat. This and much more. Stay tuned. VideoGamersOasis.com Play Subscribe This episode of Video Gamers Oasis Play Theater is brought to you by Feature Points Get free gift cards Games And much more Try free apps Get rewards Go to your iOS or Android browsers And type HTTP colon forward slash forward slash f e a t u dot r e forward slash v g o use the app start reaping the rewards and i'm here with another walkthrough of our um with our adventure with our hero gwydion and if you have been following my videos you will understand what i'm doing so far because uh, the adventure has advanced quite so much and uh we possibly will be near the end of our adventure so I'm very excited about that so make sure to uh, watch all the videos of this playlist of King's Quest 3 to Eros Human Walkthrough before you watch this video because you may not fully understand what's happening on here so uh, <clears throat> we're gonna continue our adventure we're gonna do it in our spell um, what we're gonna do uh, we're gonna do some more spells. See if we can. How much time we have? Uh, at least we'll start off with a stone of teleportation spell. So we've already. It was just finish off uh, where we left off, and cat porridge, and we're just going to pause the game for a few seconds. So you've been watching my last episode of the video. We we did is we made a <coughs> turn someone into a cat spell, and we turned we created a. A magical cookie put it in a porridge so we're gonna feed that to Manan and turn him into a cat before we do that we have to do a few more spells to fully equip ourselves so we can totally liberate ourselves from Manan's grip this time we're going to do a stone of teleportation spell I'm reading a walkthrough here so that's why I'm talking really holding the cell phone here uh, see the spell section if you want, but I can still tell you how to do it. First, flip to the page of the said spells. We're going to do the Stone of Teleportation spell. So we're still at the spell part. <coughs> uh, this is the last page. Stone of. Uh, where's the st Stone of Teleportation? This is the first page. Uh, teleportation random. All right, we're gonna save that progress. Place with teleportation spell. Okay, place. Excuse me, pardon me, a little burp there. <clears throat> All right, uh, put um. First, flip to the page of the said spell, open the inventory, choose the salt, and exit out of the spell book. We need to go to the inventory, get the salt. The cream colored toadstool powder is fine. No, I don't want the toadstool powder, I want the salt. Where's the salt? There's nothing very interesting <coughs> about this jar of whitish, thick lard. No, I don't want lard, I want salt, please. You eagerly peek inside the soft leather coat. No, it's not it either. You're carrying a handful of coarse grains of salt. Yes. Okay, and then exit from the from the spell book. And we need to okay. Salt and exit of the salt bell. Put the salt into the mortar and pestle. Alright. Salt in the mortar pestle. You measure one spoonful of salt and pour it into the mortar. Okay, save progress. 
Now we're going to um, switch to the hand cursor and use the mortar and pestle to grind the salt. Pull, pull, put the salt into the mortar pestle and switch to the hand cursor. And use the mortar pestle. Okay. You grind the salt with the pestle. All right. Good. Save progress. Now. Open the inventory again, choose the mistletoe, and put it into the mortar and pestle. Mistletoe. Kissing under the mistletoe. The dried sprig of mistletoe is a thick grayish green with remnants okay. of little berries still attached. It is not a pretty plant. Alright. But it's still good for kissing people on Christmas Eve. You place the sprig of mistletoe in the mortar. Okay, save progress. <clears throat> now, put it to mortar and pestle, switch to the hand cursor, use the mortar and pestle to grind up the mistletoe, and open them very again. So, grind up the mistletoe. You grind the mistletoe with the pestle. Okay, that's done so far. And now, we need to open the inventory. Choose the ground, round stone this time. Choose the round stone this time and use it on the mortar and pestle. Where's the round stone? You need to find the round stone. The three acorns are dry and brittle. No, I don't want in, I don't want acorns. I want round stone. Ah! The stone is smooth, round, and an unusual color. Somewhat like that of amber. That's what we want. You rub the stone in the mixture. Okay, save progress. <coughs> now, we got the stone rubbed up. Using a more, uh... So the mortal puzzle and open the inventory again, switch to the hand cursor, click the stone, and return to the spell book. Ah, uh, okay. Was that again? It's the hand cursor, click the stone. Click the hand cursor. You gently kiss the stone. Okay. Save progress. Now, return to the spell book and re recite the spell. Here we go. With trepidation, you prepare to recite the teleportation at random incantation. My kiss so tender I now give. All right. So that I may have a chance to live, seeking a place of trouble less. Yes. In my smooth stone. I shall caress. And now we get the... What we need to do now... Recite the spell and then click, uh, use the wand on the stone. And ta-da! You wave the magic wand over the stone. Alright, nice. We got it done, guys. We got the magical teleportation spell. Now, <clears throat> what's the next step? Uh, switch to the hand cursor, click the stone, and return to the spell book. Recite the stone. Now leave the basement. I'll, it'll be easy. It might be easier to use a stone at this point. Okay. Let's see if this teleportation stone works. You rub the magic stone. Oh shit. Yikes, I didn't want to go there. You rub the magic stone. Oh shit. A shame what happened to old Roger. Charming old oh. Roger. <laughs> oh, he's quite a You can understand the can understand the animals now. That's funny. I'll say something to the wizard got through with them. Especially after 
after the wizard got through with him. Buck, buck, buck. <laughs> buck, buck, buck. Uh, pretty. Buck, buck, buck. He comes up to visit after hours. Uh, terribly confused. Buck, buck. Or to eat our spot. Ah, that's hilarious. Chickens can talk because we understand their words. Now let's quickly get in here before man finds out. You close that that uh, door. You quickly pull the levers in the correct sequence. All right. We need to go to the, the the locker. The cabinet door locks as you shut it. No, we don't want to lock it yet. We want to use the key on the lock. You unlock the oak cabinet using the brass key. And we want to put the wand back into the the locker. You carefully replace the magic wand exactly as you found it. Okay. There, there is nothing enter. We can close the, the door now. The cabinet door locks as you uh, uh, Now we can save our progress. Teleportation spell saved. Now, where do we need to go now? Let's uh, see our progress of our game. Uh, pause it, I mean. And we need to go to... <clears throat> Close the trap door and put the wand back into the safe. Return to your room. Hide all your stuff except for the porridge and sleep. All right, let's do that now. Let's go upstairs to our bedroom. to our bedroom hide all our objects hide all the objects except one hide all and keep our porridge retrieve our porridge we'll examine our porridge you were careful when you crumbled the cat cookie into the porridge. It looks just like a plain bowl of porridge. Sweet. Nice. Save our progress as cat porridge. The place. And we pause our game. We put away all our objects except for the porridge. Close trap door. <clears throat> Return to your room. Hide all your stuff except for the porridge and sleep. Let's sleep now. We've done enough good stuff now. Now it's time to pick a break. Sleep. All right, now we can get up, save our progress at porridge, and see what Manan Manan wants. <clears throat> Here he is. I am ravenous. Fix me something immediately. Yes, sir. We'll do that right away. So let's go to our room, take a break, save a game. Now we're, we're not done yet. We're just gonna... Alright, instructions say, um... Return to your room, hide all your stuff. When you wake up, uh, to our... For the chickens. Clean the kitchen or his office. Uh, now Goody is funny. Ah. Uh, now watch the scene. If you see a banana turning into a kitty, this is the part we want to we want to show you, folks. All right, let's go downstairs. This is gonna be so beautiful. This is gonna be so beautiful, my friends. Oh, I can't I can't begin to tell you how awesome this will be. My, mon my, my, my mouth seems to have frozen up here. Ah, uh, why is this doing this to me? Uh, okay, now I got it. Now I am uh, officially bugged here, uh, irritated. Uh, 
Sorry about that gamers, I seem to have had a problem with uh, the computer crashed. But, so thankful to the universe, so thankful I was able to retrieve my uh, temporary file on my computer and be able to retrieve it and save it as a part one and a part two. So now I'm able to complete our, our adventure for this uh, episode and let's continue on. What we're going to do, we're going to feed Mananan the magic porridge to transform him into a kitty. So let's do this. Check our, uh, yep, we got our, we got our porridge right here. You were careful when you crumbled the cat <clears throat> cookie into the porridge. It looks just like a plain bowl of porridge. But it's much more than just a plain bowl of porridge. It's magic porridge. And it's going to transform our sinister Mananan into a kitty. Let's talk to him. Mananan is impatiently waiting for his food. We're just gonna give him. His stomach rumbles as he drums his All right, fingers on the table. You'd better feed him quickly, or dire consequences may result. All right, Mananan, it's feeding time. Let's get our food and give it to Mananan. And enjoy ourselves watching watching him. Eat up, Mananan, eat up. Ah, see what happens to him. So that'll be good. Oh boy, here it comes. Oh man! What happened to him? Oh, able to control a smile nice. From spreading over your face. Oh the yes. The chokes on his little snack and clutches his throat. He seems to be turning a somewhat bluish color. Hmm. Oh. Go. As the wizard manages to swallow the tainted, once hidden cookie, he greedily gulps the remainder of the porridge. There's more of it. You watch, hoping for a sign that the spell will begin its work. But it seems the wizard is unaffected. All right. Okay. His effect unaffected. Why? Huh. Something is wrong. I feel strange. Hmm. Really? Really? Maybe you should curl up. Have a cat nap. Indeed. What was in that porridge? A cookie? A cookie? Ha. <laughs> Oh, ah, that'd be good. Cookie. Ah, yes. You know, that reminds me of a poem. Root of mandrake and fish oil, with cat hair over which I toil. Oh, boy. This is good. My spell! Yes! Oh, Indeed. You know that one. Aha! Uh -huh. You! You! How you. dare you! Yes? Uh, yes? You won't get away with this. You'll be sorry, Gwydion. Oh, really? Ha ha! Mew! My name is Alexander. Alexander! Ha 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 ha! Cat! Nice. Let's look at the cat. Furry and furious, the wizard must contend with fleas and fur balls. You've had enough to do with that creature. Let's save our progress. Cat porridge, or uh, let's see, let's replace this as uh, hmm. Place feed banana with uh, replace that with banana kitty. All right. Pause your game. And what's next on the stay on the on the agenda? Now Gwydion finally is finally free of the evil wizard, but we still have some more spells to do. Save your game. Return your, to to your room for your stuff. Go back to Manan's basement. The next spell is the deep slumber spell. So we got more stuff to do. We st the mission is not over. The game is not over. But we have defeated Manan. So let's save our progress and Manan Kitty and. And let's go over to. Oh, this is so sweet. Manana can't do a damn thing to me now. He's helpless. Helpless, I tell you. Oh, wow. What happened to the painting? Strange. There's nothing in the painting now. Not much behind, above, <coughs> or below the painting. That was weird. Not much behind, above, or below the painting. That is really weird. I don't know why it, why that's so. Let's go upstairs now. Let's 
Let's go to our room and we'll do some more fun adventuring next episode. So save our game. Ah. Uh, hide our items. We got nothing to hide. Uh, let's go for a sleep. I'm tired. You don't plan on spending another day in this house. Your future lies elsewhere. Okay, let's save our progress. We've done enough work. Um, Manan and Kitty. And we'll take a break and quit for now. Quit. Yes, oh, you want to quit? Yes, I'm sure. Gamers, I'd like to thank you for watching me play King's Quest 3 to Error's Human Walkthrough. In this episode of the walkthrough, we successfully created a stone of teleportation using Manan's alchemy laboratory and we were successful in transforming uh, Mananan into a cat by feeding him the magic kitty uh, cookie mashed up in his porridge. Now Mananan is a harmless kitty cat and he is at my mercy. And now Gwydion is able to continue on his adventure without the shadow of the sinister Mananan hanging over his head. Check out the other links below. I'm your host, Miki. Thanks for watching, gamers, and stay tuned for some more great gaming videos. And have a great weekend. Bye.